Hey guys, welcome to another video. Today, we're going to be doing a little haul. Finally got this in the mail. So excited. It's a very cute color for packaging. How exciting! So these are colored contacts. For those of you who are excited to see what my stretch marks are looking like, the update, and kind of know what's going on with that, stay tuned for the end of the video because I will be going ahead and showing y'all what my stomach looks like now and explaining my future plans for them in detail, so stay tuned for that. And they come in like this cute little box. All of my pairs are in here. I think I have eight. So, oh, they gave me a gift. Cute. So in total, I have eight. These I think are the gray ones, which you can't really see. They were all like different, I think, types of contacts. Um, so some of them look more natural. I think those are gonna look more natural than the other ones, but yeah. Green. This very pretty blue. And it's another blue. So I'm gonna try the blue ones on first. So when you open the box, it comes with a little case. And then the contacts are in separate little containers with like contact solution. You can smell it. It's contact solution in there. So this is very high quality. I really like these so far. <gasps> Look at how cute. Okay, so this first color is blue pearl. I think it looks so freaking gorgeous. They like a darkish blue to me on my eyes at least. They look like, I don't know. They look so freaking pretty though. Um, I cried putting these bitches in. I don't know why I didn't want to lay on my eyes right, but like I can't really see that well right now. <laughs> my eyes are so watery. Okay, um, but yeah. I actually really fucking love this color. So far, they don't feel the most comfortable, so that's a little worrisome, but we'll see as it goes. I think my eyes are just a bit irritated. They didn't really want to stay in the way I expected it to. Um, I don't know, like it kept creasing up in my eye and stuff, and like I haven't put in contacts in a long time, so I think that's really what it is, but yeah. All right, the removal is so easy. It took me like less than a second to get them out, so that's great. They're very like thin, but they make them feel so soft. Like, I don't know. I don't explain it. Like, <sighs> mine is so better. It feels so much better. Whew. But yeah, I freaking love this color. They're so gorgeous. On to the next. So the next ones I really want to try are the purple ones, which are called Raven. And they come in a different colored case, thankfully. So the blue ones are wearing a pink one. This one's like a super baby blue slash purple um, and I'm taking the sticker off of the name and putting it at the bottom of the case because I'm just going to keep the case and throw the boxes away so it's convenient to just read what that con that contact is so yeah these are very stuck together and I'm scared of like dropping water so I'm just like slowly peeling it as carefully as possible okay there we go. Open the left. Okay, so it's this one. You kind of have to make sure it's like in a scoopy way. So. So as you can see, it's a little difficult to get it in. So. My eyes already wanted to cry. technical difficulties. 
six and a half hours later. I finally got it. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, do y'all see this? I'm not gonna try them all on today. I have like 10 minutes before I have to go to work and um, it's really hurting my eyes. So, not the contact, not putting them in. It's just too much. I'm just gonna take these to work. They're cute. I'm gonna take them to work. And I'm gonna try the rest on tomorrow. Hopefully. Because honestly, it's a lot. Hmm, real cute. Yeah. I look like I've been crying for days or something, but you know, real cute. <laughs> I love the ring of pink and um, yeah, and I love the ring on the outside, like the dark one, because it makes it somehow just give it more of a, a realistic look, but just like an anime vibe so these are the cosplay ones um one of the how the pink ones are cosplay ones and these i don't know if i got any more because the cosplay ones were a bit more expensive so i didn't get that many of those but yeah i'll see you tomorrow when i try on the rest because i can't do it right now girl i just cannot so Yeah, <laughs> goodbye, goodbye. Good morning, it's the next day and I have tried on the next pair. This one is Russian blue. I really like these, I feel like all of them so far have looked very natural like you could really think that this is someone's real eye color unless like you really really look up close they still look very they look really cool so, um, i'm gonna try on another blue pair right after this just to like compare so i think i'm gonna take one out and then try the other one on this side and then see how they look um, this next one is called Vegas Girl. It's another blue, so let's see. So this one's Vegas Girl. Sorry about my crying, but there is a big difference. Oops, I have my freaking Harley Quinn show over here. Um, but yeah, this one's a lot lighter and more green in the middle, and this one's darker. Oh, I can't stop crying. It does kind of really hurt. Um, okay, these are the next ones. They're called Classy Green. Look at the main guys. Okay, I gave my eyes a good like few hours of rest because they burn. They still burn um, and I really didn't want to do this right now but I just want to get this filmed today so we're going to go ahead and keep going. I have three more pairs um, so what I'm going to do is just do one eye and see it like that because honestly I really don't, I cannot handle Especially this eye, it hurts very bad, so I'm not gonna keep doing both eyes. This one is Polar Lights Gray, and when you see it in the packaging, it looks like there's nothing in there. Like, they look super transparent with the white of this, and when you grab them, you can also barely see them, and they don't look pigmented at all, but when you put them in, do you see that? It definitely looks gray. Like. And they look so natural, like what? These have a real gradient to them, it's like a real eye color does. Normal eyes aren't just plain one color all around. If you really look into an eye, there's a lot of detail in it. 
which like mine don't look like that right now they're just brown you know but any people with colored eyes like if they were to have um green or blue eyes it has detail in it and a lot of contacts don't have that these look so good because of that um anyways these are the ones i was super excited about these are called love they're the pink ones and they have this little heart pupil in it so i'm excited to try these on these are like obviously for cosplay um so well um So it's actually hard to see through this one. Um, it just looks like everything's very dark, and it you can just not see as normal compared to um, the other ones. You can see right through them. They do have a little bit of like a foggy look. As soon as you take them on, you can see very clearly. But this one it's actually very hard to see with them like i probably would not be able to drive with these in but they look so freaking cool don't they like a real anime character dude i love it for cosplay these are perfect the last pair i have are polar lights brown i didn't order these i got these as a free gift so i'm excited to see what they will look like but yeah, let me go ahead and pop that out. Ah, I can see so much better now. I think as I practice putting them in, they feel better. But I don't know if it's the solution or what, but it really hurts my eyes. It makes it super watery. Like my eyes, I used to be really good with just being able to touch my eyes and like mm, not being bothered. But I don't know. Maybe I just haven't put contacts in them forever. Maybe that's why. But these you know just like the gray they are a certain type of contact that they have so they're the polar lights contacts this is the polar lights in gray this one's the polar lights in brown this one looks like a very almost orangey tone in there so i don't know what it's gonna look like so it's a very slight difference It does have like a more orange ring around my actual eye like it doesn't fit it right but um it's cool like if you just want a little bit of a lighter color for the day or something it's cool it's really cool so these do feel like a bit thinner the polar lights ones compared to the other ones I'm not sure maybe I'm tripping they all do feel very light uh, maybe it's just the fact that you can barely see them but the cosplay ones definitely do feel heavier like just just a tiny bit thicker and you can definitely tell when you like grab it the material feels a little different so um those are all the contacts um my eyes hurt but i'm so glad i finally got to finish filming and yeah that's basically it um thank you guys for watching and i'm so sorry i have not posted in literally like a month i have been struggling um with my daily life to just get out of bed honestly <sighs> not sure why i have a few ideas why but it happens i'm just learning to cope really so if you guys have any ideas of any videos y'all want to see please let me know i also did stop microneedling and i am working towards different things i'm actually just working very hard to save for my tummy tuck because that's my goal when it comes to my stretch marks now i haven't given up on them i just i know these treatments they were worth a lot of money and they didn't really do anything that i wanted to be done um so i'm just ready for my tummy tuck and i decided i'm gonna get the bbl with the tummy tuck um but if you guys want to see my stretch marks i'm going to be showing you guys now a little update So they're still very much there. It has officially been two years and nine months since I 
have given birth. Um, I'm going on three years with the stretch marks and they just don't go away. A lot of people that don't really know about them always say, oh no, like they go away, they'll get better. Um, yeah, but this, I, I cannot feel comfortable in a freaking tank top with this. And my belly still hangs. I have all that loose skin still. So the only thing that will get rid of this is a tummy tuck because this is all really just skin. So, yep, that's my update on that.